So here we have a rectangle inscribed in a circle. If the radius of the circle is 10, this line I have drawn in here is a diameter, which is going to be 20 if the radius is 10. We're going to find the area of the rectangle as a function of its width. So the two dimensions of a rectangle are length and width. Area of that rectangle is length times width. And in order to tie these things together, we need to come up with another equation based off of the information that's in our easy. We have a triangle, a right triangle. Since it's a right triangle, you can use Pythagorean theorem. A squared plus B squared equals C squared, which would be L squared plus W squared equals 20 squared, or 400. So we're finding the area in terms of width, which means we're keeping W in the formula, we're getting rid of L. So to get rid of L, we're going to solve for L. Subtract width squared W squared from both sides. L squared, so square root both sides. We don't need to worry about plus or minus for this because length can only be positive. So I'm going to take the positive square root and substitute that square root in for L. We get area equals L, which is the square root of 400 minus W squared times W. There's a formula for area in terms of width. W is the only variable left. 